If you have no G18 stored drapery rods, prepare these tools to measure curtain size you need. 1. Determine drapery rod or track width. 2. Decide whether or not to use drapery rings. Drapery rings include hook rings and clip rings. They need to be purchased separately. Rod ring works for pinch, pleated, goblet and flat hook header style. Clip rings works for broad, pocket and flat hook header style. 3. Determine rod placement. Four, determine drapery finished width. Measure rod or track full length, not simply the window itself. If tracks have a center overlap, measure it separately and add it to your end-to-end -end measurement. The measurement you take here is your total pull or track width that your curtains will be covering. Five, fullness. To avoid draperies to look like a stretched sheet, you need to consider adding fullness for additional width to cover. Curtains and draperies should be one to two times the final measured width. Less fullness will produce a more tailored look, while more fullness will create a richer, more opulent appearance. You determine the fullness ratio to create folds according to header style. You determine how many panels you need to achieve the desired fullness. Fullness ratio varies by header style. 6. Finished length. Measure the desired length of your drapery. Keep in mind the hardware type you plan to use and where it will be mounted. The finished length you supply us is the exact measurement to which the drapery will be made. Measuring finished length method varies by header style.